All right, so I've been waiting a few days to progress. First off, leave a like, subscribe up. I'm doing something very stupid on this account. Uh, so I, I was originally planning to not summon or not do anything because so so first in my last video you probably be like dude you lied you said you were going to summon well i lied to you also because i did not know they would announce it this early i, I didn't know that they were going to announce the ssr plus right so now we're in a situation of what do we do what, what do we do right um so i will only right now buy the copy if i if i like the character it's gonna be at zero dupes so we're gonna test out just see what the character does at zero dupes um because some characters can work at zero dupes technically if they're passive and whatever works really well right like for example this is gonna be a very rough example so just take this and run with it um when i use endorsey here and there and i swap her in for a little bit or when i use that red support character for a little bit uh they actually can help me clear stage and then push me a little bit up and then like i switch back to my main team uh so yes yeah, so theoretically a character can help you at zero dupes but it's always better to have dupes right and this character's not a dps character right we're, we're more so aiming for a tank character as we kind of presume um, but here we go I'm the honey, uh, honeybee who will rule the human world. And we got the uh, beautiful, beautiful art. Um, looking looking pretty cool. All right, so I turn audio on real quick just so we have that. Uh, character acquired. So let's go into the uh, equipment area and see what we can give this character. So we have this. Let's auto-equip whatever equipment we got. Uh, ooh, get some decent equipment minus this piece over here, which I think I can strip some somebody. I can take from my hats. Sorry, hats. Forgive me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we just we just took it from my hats, but come on, dude. Uh, we'll give you we'll give you back this. All right, so that's what this character is looking like. The proficiency. Let's see what the weapon is. Let's let's see the stats and everything. Uh, what this character can do. Uh, so first, let's look at the brick. I'm curious, right? So we're gonna jump up to fifty percent. No freaking way. Oh, it's much more than what the leak was. The leak said twenty. Fifty percent defense increase for each yellow element teammate. 50% and it restores 12 and then 40% damn okay let's read through these all right oh my god all right let's go through it Vespa's defense increases uh, by 50% for each yellow element teammate other than herself on the uh or at the start of the battle in addition if Vespa receives constant damage debuff her bees pour honey into the honey pot to remove the debuff immediately while restoring 12% of her max HP. Cool down 10 seconds. If Vespa's HP drops to 20% or less, she activates the honey pot to deal 40% of her HP and provide constant damage debuff immunity to nearby allies for 20 seconds. Afterwards, the honey pot will not activate again. So she has a one-time, one-time heal and um, immunity uh, kind of gimmick there, which is cool, really cool. Vespa's little bees cling on and deal 80%. That jumps up to 95. So, not a bad thing. And if they're paralyzed, it's always going to count as a critical attack, uh, which is very good. Uh, Vespa targets the enemy's weak points and deals 200% uh, of her attack as damage. Afterwards, uh, little bees appear. Oh. Oh. Okay. And attack the target twice to deal 200% extra on top of that, right? Of her attack um, as damage both times. The target hit by this attack will have their blood flow interrupted for 20 seconds becoming paralyzed for two seconds each time vespa and her bees land 20 attacks against them so we'll have to see how this kicks up um it's not that bad looking over here vespa locks the enemy for two seconds then uses deadly sting to poison the enemy and deal 500 percent of the attack as damage the poison target takes 20 percent of her attack as damage every second for 20 seconds and receives the additional debuff based on the poison dura uh, poison duration Right after being poisoned, the target swiftness decreases by 20 for 10 seconds, which is also pretty good. Then by 40 for the next 10 seconds, and then finally they are paralyzed for 4 seconds. So she has a lot of paralyze in her kit, and given what we're seeing here, obviously this second skill is going to activate very well. So that's there. Poison effect um, and additional debuff cannot be removed, and Vespa becomes immune to status effects while using the skill. I mean, pretty good character, not going to lie. What is, the, uh, what is the weapon? What is this weapon going to grant us? Uh, adds additional HP recovery amount to a honey pot based on 5% of max HP when it is used to remove a constant damage debuff. And then critical rate will increase by 50% or critical damage. That's actually pretty good. Uh, the number of hits required to trigger weak point strike paralyzed reduced to 15. That's also really good. And then deadly sting swiftness decrease effect is changed to swiftness steal. So that's there. Can I write this up right now? <laughs> yeah, hell no. 
Okay, that's gone. So we can try out this character and see what we can do here in um, some regular content. So realize there's no book attached so far. This is just basically buying the character. Again, it's not going to be a proper showcase. We're, gonna, we're probably going to lose right away. And then I will switch it up a little bit. Um, and then, you know, I'll probably have to summon. Because this character looks good on paper. Looks to be pretty good. So I will throw in data, data mass for this. So we'll just go with we'll go with this team. Yeah. We have data mass tanking. Uh, we theoretically have, what, two light characters helping also. Hua is in. So I'm going to probably remove Hua also and put on, like, hats or something. Uh, or Wang, because currently I only have dupes for Wang. <laughs> Couldn't get a dupe for, for hats since launch, which on this count would suck. But let's see what happens here. So we have this character here. Um, like, again, if this character can tank very well, currently he's getting, like, shredded. There is the first uh, buff, correct? For the uh, the heal that we have from the honeypot. So we kind of cleared the stage very fast. Very fast. It's not bad. But how did the character do? So it's zero dupes to do any damage. Okay, but again, zero dupes. I'm not going to say anything. There's no proficiency. There's nothing. Realize that now. So we're not going to say too much here. Um, the healing was kicked off by the character uh, herself. Uh, but the tanking was pretty good in comparison, right? In a way. No. Like, yeah. No, not really. All right. Let's keep going. We're going to try it. As soon as we start failing, I'll just dupe, the, uh, dupe up the character a little bit. I'm hoping that I can pull out some dupes, but I don't know if that's going to happen. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see how that goes. But um, yeah, so for the most part, the character's purpose is the tank. And she took a lot of damage there. If you increase that passive, it's going to be like 70% per light character. Okay, so like if we remove Hua and we put on like hats, right, you're going to get another 50% on top of that defense increase. So the B is still alive at zero dupes. Hua died right away. How did how did uh, the uh, twenty four? Okay, let's let's give let's let's remove Hua and then add on hats, an additional light character to use. Correct. Let's do it that way. So goodbye Hua. Where is we'll put Wang for now. Yeah. So I don't have if I had Evan and a duped out hats. Realize that Mass would get replaced by by Evan. So that's there. But um, yeah. Plus, if I, if I pull two copies, I can get the third copy for free. Ah, <sighs> decisions, decisions. I don't know what to do here. Let's see here what we do. So, my my data mass is getting obliterated, but my Vespa is staying pretty strong. Um, Wow, okay. Didn't take any damage there, really. Let's see how that did. Uh, That's what it looks like. So, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just get some dupes real quick, just so I can do the showcase proper. But at zero... Hey, I'm clearing stages. I was stuck here for a little bit, so I don't know what happened. <laughs> Is she paralyzing that much? I have no idea. Now let's see. I'm very curious on what happens here. Like, I'm so curious on how this goes, but um, I think that Vespa will be pretty good based on what we see. So now Vespa theoretically has a 240% defense increase. The more dupes you get, you're basically getting an almost 400% defense increase. So Hats died right away, which I knew was going to happen. So look at that. He got, so she got, I have to keep saying she. Vespa got a heal off there, and she's dead now, but she had the heal off and everything. Like, that is, it's a sort of revive in a way, and she pr practically procs that very fast. For the most part, I mean, she tanked a, a little bit, right? She tanked a lot in comparison. I don't know. I don't know. Again, you well invest the character, you're de you're definitely going to be able to clear. My hats is just going to keep dying, so let's, let's kind of swap uh, hats there, do it this way. Yeah. So the, the team is entirely light, correct? Team is entirely light. Um, correct. So if if you had Evan, imagine the survivability you're giving. You know, your uh, Vespa. Like imagine the survivability you're gaining. So let's see here. Again, Hats dies right away because he doesn't have any dupes, right? Vespa gets off the heal. Now Vespa's dead. But remember, you already. Can you activate your ult? She didn't activate her ult. What is she doing? <laughs> She wasn't activating her ult. What the hell was that? This is why. Sometimes you want to auto it yourself or manual it yourself. She wasn't activating her ult and she had it for so long. She had activated it. She would have killed. The hell was that? But, um, yeah. You're you're giving Yun a chance to proc that. So, imagine if you had dupes on uh, Vespa. Because, again, every character needs dupes. Correct? Every character needs dupes. You can clearly see how fast Hats dies in comparison. Every character needs dupes. And, uh, dupes. And every character, there you go, finally activates it. So you see, it gives Yun a chance to actually activate her buffs. And look at the look at the damage you've done. So take out this one character. There we go. Done. Look at that, dude. 
<laughs> so you're giving yourself an absolutely broken tank for the team. Correct? Again, it's only a one dude. We want to make sure that's clear. But for the most part, like we're progressing. I was originally stuck here for a little bit. So given I could progress a little bit, it's much better. Um, yeah, if I had more dupes on hats, it would have been much better. I think that's all the gear I have, right? I think, I think Wang doesn't have any good gear. Yeah, I can put good gear on Wang. And, or better gear on Wang at least, right? But let's see again. So Hats is going to keep dying. But when, when Hats has so many dupes, he does much better. And plus Hats doesn't even have that decent gear. Uh, we basically only have Vespa with one of the red pieces there. But um, remember, Hats skills very well with dupes. We just sadly don't have any. And I just summoned, right? I just summoned and went miserable. Like pulling, oh, I have so many characters on raid if I didn't get anything. That's how sad it was. So here we go. Vespa activates the ultimate. So now they're stunned for a little bit. Now that gives, again, Yun a chance to activate this. Um, she died here, though, right? But let's see. If we reset this one, I think we can get this one. I think we can. But she did die pretty fast there. Uh, let's try again. See what we can do. Vespa is tanking, though. I can't lie. Vespa. I can also upgrade Vespa's uh, slot. Because I think that she can definitely use a bit more there. So let's see. Okay, Yun's going to activate her ult pretty soon. Vespa's dead now. Here's the ult. She's getting a lot of misses there. And then she's dead. So she gets rushed there, but let me let me, let me up, uh, upgrade... Uh, what is it? My, my Vespa real quick, also. All right, we give my characters a pretty decent boost here. Uh, so we should be able to clear the stage 100% now. We give uh, Vespa 131, and then upgrade a little bit on the side there. So let's see what we can do. Uh, this one should work now. So, um, but yeah, for the most part, am I am I happy with what this character looks like? I think she's going to be a very great tank. The amount of defense you have there is is very nuts. Okay, so again, this showcase might come off a little bit scuffed, but we just didn't get any dupes for her, correct? She is still putting up, like, look at that. She's still putting up great uh, abilities there with the defense. Like, look at that, dude. She kind of healed there. Imagine teaming up Evan with uh, Vespa, right? It's going to be an absolute nasty comp. So here we go. We're getting off all the damage. Come on. No. One shot, Rachel. Come on, no. Oh, my God. You suck, Wang. So close there. Rachel was one shot. Oh, my. But still, I think that um, for, I, I don't know. If you're not going to run yellow team, she's dog crap. Correct? I think if you're not running mono team, mono yellow team, she's dog crap. So, yeah. That, that's, my, that's, my, that's my quick take. If you're not running mono uh, team with her, she's going to be a terrible character. Because her paralyze isn't really doing too much. You mainly see like the entire purpose that we're using her is just defending. Right, can, we, can we kill Rachel this time? Thank you. Oh my god. One shot on Rachel. Um, but yeah, if you, if you dupe her out and you're running through, uh, story with, with her, uh, as the main mono team carry, then you're good. Other than that, no, no, I don't think so. Simply put, so that's my, that's my 10 cents. Right? That's my 10 cents. Um, yeah, like you're not, you're not getting a DPS carry. Hats is like, Hats is a sort of pseudo tank in a way where he'll do very great, but like, you can see, she takes a lot of damage. And she's she's holding off pretty well, right? So, Vespa's dead now. But it gave us a chance to already activate our fire ultimate. So, we're getting off all the damage there. Perfect. Hats is still kicking it. So, no way. No way she could. She got stunned, bro. She got stunned. All right, let's try it again. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. I per again, let's end this let's end this with a perfect review. I wouldn't summon right now. I'd wait for the SSR plus and then summon. And then they just put put Vespa on a right up then. Correct? Because we're gonna have that whole entire thing up uh, up and coming soon. There's no reason to summon right now. If you wanna uh, like she's gonna be a very good, very good character for the team, 100 percent But do you need it right now? If you if you need a tank for your yellow team, then get it. Like people that just summoned on Yana that doesn't have hats built. Are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> my, team is, my team is not being able to kill that. Uh, if I keep resetting this, like, look at how much damage she's doing. Like, look at how much tanking is happening here. But, I don't know. Yeah. What, what would I say? Like, Yun is broken. Vespa is good at tanking. That's it. 
Would I say she's worth a 3k? I think you just buy her a 3,000, that's it. And then look at dupes later on. She She's gonna be really good. She's a very good tank character, 100%. It's just, if you're not running yellow team, she's useless. If you're going to run yellow team, she's gonna be really good, but you need to dupe her. With every character, you need to dupe the character, simply put. Uh, you can clearly see most of my characters won't do anything if they're not duped, right? So, running on that aspect of it, I think she's a pretty good character. And low dupes, I was still, I'll be, I was still pushing, and I can definitely push a bit, a bit more. But you can see my my team is currently like not getting dupes, and I'm on three. Look at this, I have three SSR pluses. I've made three rotations, so I never pulled an actual SSR plus. I've just made rotations around and, and pulled them on the thing, right? So I made three full rotations, and only my Yun is getting love. These characters are just no one has dupes, bro. <laughs> I don't know how that's the case, but that is the case. So, hope you enjoyed the video. It's a pretty long one here, but yeah.